paper shredder's jammed up, it's not working right. First thing you need to do is like pretty much every electrical appliance whatsoever. What's the first thing you do before you touch anything else? You unplug it. In the case of a paper shred shredder, unplugging the device is handy because it might be that the, um, that the motors are just running hot. It might be you're just running, you've just shredded a ton of stuff and the, the motor just needs a break. So um, the first thing I would do is unplug it, let it sit for about an hour, let it cool down, and then try it again and see if it works. The next step, if, if, powering on, if leaving it powered off for a while to let the motor cool is not the issue. The next thing you'll want to do is we're going to try to use the auto clear feature that, mo that pretty much every shredder has. It's also commonly known as the reverse. So right here it's set to on, you know, the automatic function which basically turns the shredder on as soon as it touches paper. What you'll want to do is switch the device to reverse. That will cause the motors to run in reverse and, back, and it should back the paper out. If it doesn't just back it out on the first try, you might want to stop for a moment, put it in normal mode again for a moment, for a couple seconds probably, switch it back and then switch it back to reverse again. Basically try toggling it like that a few times. Make sure to just maybe no more than a couple of seconds on each one. And that should clear it. What happens if reverse doesn't clear it? This is where things get a little more interesting. When you look at the rollers, as we can see I've used this shredder recently, um, you'll want to possibly see if there's a big hunk of paper you want to try pulling that out very gently. You can pull slowly and it's not going to damage the motor. Don't, don't yank it. If you yank it, you could damage the motors and more importantly, you could leave uh, a piece of paper that you actually need to get out of there stuck and you just rip off the part that was you know, easy to grab. So, if, you know, pull the big piece of paper out first. And then if there are any little bits left that are just stubborn that won't come out, use a pair of tweezers to get in there safely without cutting your fingers and pull pieces out. 